Welcome to our special story time for Grug's 40th year. Today we are going to read some Grug stories. Our first story today is Grug by Ted Pryor, published by Simon and Schutzer. Once the top of a barangwang tree fell to the ground. And the grassy top began to change. It became grug. Can you see a nose, two eyes and a mouth? Away he went to look for a place to live. He went through the forest, through the snow. Can you see Grug's tracks through the snow? Until he reached a green mountain. It's a very big mountain. There Grug found a deserted burrow. He worked. I think Grug's carrying a big rock up the mountain. And worked. He's adding more rocks. I wonder what he's making. To make a fireplace. Can you see the fireplace? That will keep Grug nice and warm in winter. Then he made a bed of grass. Do you think Grug might sleep on that bed of grass? I think so. Grug's house was almost finished. It's a very nice house, isn't it? What else did he need, I wonder? Can you think what else Grug might need? A letterbox. There's Grug's letterbox that says letters. So Grug is waiting for some letters. There's lots and lots of Grug books to enjoy. Grug has many adventures. We're going to have another one now. We're going to read Grug Learns to Dance. You might like to join Grug at home to dance. Grug by Ted Pryor. Publisher Simon and Schutzer. The parcel had arrived and it was a learn to dance kit for Grug. There's Grug opening up his parcel. Grug began the first lesson. Can you see Grug? He's got a book and some headphones. He put his left foot up. Can you put your left foot up? He put his right foot up. Can you join Grug and put your right foot up? Oh, then he spun around and round. Can you spin around and round at home like Grug? Don't get dizzy. Oh, then he bumped into a tree. Lesson two, take your partner. Grug swept Kara into his arms. That's his friend. Left foot, right foot. Turn round and round. They look like they're having fun, don't they? Do your own dance, said Kara, 
and she slithered away. I don't think Kara wanted to dance. Hands together, are you ready? Put your right foot out. Feet together, put your left foot out. Hug yourself and turn around. Shake your right leg, shake your left leg. Are you ready to join Grug? Jump and shout, I'm doing the Grug. Give yourselves a big clap for dancing so well today. Now we're going to meet Grug. Grug is coming to the library. Are you ready to dance with Grug? Welcome to the library, Grug. We're so happy to have you today. We're going to do the Grug Dance. Are you going to join us at home to do the Grug Dance? Okay, on the count of three. One, two, three. Put your right foot in, you put your right foot out, you put your right foot in and you grew the Gruggy Dance. You turn around and that's what it's all about. You put your left foot in, you put your left foot out, you put your left foot in and you shake it all about. You do the groggy dance and you turn around. That's what it's all about. Thank you, Grug, for joining us for that dance. Thank you, everyone, for joining us for story time. We'll see you again another day. We're ready for our goodbye song. One, two, Three. We've had a happy day, we've had a happy day. Wave goodbye to everyone, we've had a happy day. We'll see you again, we'll see you again. Wave goodbye to everyone, we'll see you again. Goodbye.